have a good time. Put a smile on your face, yeah. Keep me caring. Elation Radio. Mm-hmm. Even brighten your day and help you through the night. Bring you good music. Keep me caring. Elation Radio. And here's your host. God's field, and we are his children and his seeds, planted on good soil or bad soil from one's actions, ways, and deeds. Uh, we got seeds in the field, with many dreams to fulfill, too many seeds getting killed, Lord, we need your will, to restore and rebuild, no more seeds getting killed, we got seeds in the field, with many dreams to fulfill, too many seeds getting killed, Lord, we need your will, to restore and rebuild, no more seeds getting killed. I feed them God's word like Gerber babies, I burp them, give them a verbal sermon, they learn and grow in their purpose, fully grown, it's on and now they're putting and working, exercising, they teaching, they skilled and fighting off demons in this battlefield, if killer be killing, it's killing season, brothers blasting heaters without even having good reason, possessed by them demons, the reasons the bullets squeezing, facetious, bickering, fleeing the murder scene, and he's leaking, tripping and covered in blood, he bleeding, he's wheezing, coughing up blood, asking for Jesus for forgiveness for his sick, sadistic way of living, just in the midst of dying, he prayed this, Lord receive my soul, I'm about to get killed, I understand I'm a seed in your field, we got seeds in the field, with many dreams to fulfill, too many seeds getting killed, Lord we need your will, to restore and rebuild, no more seeds getting killed, we got seeds in the field, with many dreams to fulfill, too many seeds getting killed, Lord we need your will, to restore and rebuild, no more seeds getting I'm killed, I'm hotter than hot pockets with rockets on the Mars and I'm about to spar with Mayweather, I'm way better, he just paid better, move the dough like future, talking too much I mute ya, I flip but no birds, I'm strapped like Stephen Curry, Government control Illuminati, they controlling our minds. Seem that all we can find is guns and knives, killing our husbands and wives. Such a shame that being a black man in this day mean that you win the gang or you win the cell being gay. No way, that's not me, not I. I don't get high, but I fly on the coat in the field. Built like steel, I will overcome any troubles in my life. No strife, me and wife doing 80 in the night. Laughing at all the haters, conversators, conversing, but they hurting. Cause I'm doing me, I stay flea. Rockin' Fendi, Ferragamo, Gucci, Louis. Got racks on top of racks, plaques on top of plaques. You swing, I'm swinging back. I'm young, gifted, and black. So as I attack, like I'm running out the backfield. I understand I'm a seed in the field. 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 Who got dreams to fulfill? And on Jesus we build. Cause he's a hand on the field. Now that's my seed in the field. Who had dreams to fulfill. Still can't believe he was killed. Lord, we need your will. To restore and rebuild. No more seeds getting killed. I raise my son with purpose. Be great on this earth surface. So great he correlated the name written in curses. Since birth I know he was the young king to bring order. Like Martin Luther King had a dream. Now he's a martyr. Started for the Spartans in college. A full scholarship. Never would have thought he got hit. Just home visiting. Lord forgive my urge to snap and go ballistic. The devil want me back to my old ways of living. But you saved me from them days and gave me a better vision. So I'm charging all his peers to carry on his tradition and solemnly swear to be diligent handle business but that i ain't a year we honoring tremendous and marching every year we repping you to the ending remembering them times we shared nothing could bear just wishing you was here in heaven we know you there got a thousand million prayers for everybody who cared that knew you was a blessing on earth when you was here even though you gone your legacy lived on long live god of my seeds to live strong Long live key ear, my seeds to live on. We got seeds in the field, with many dreams to fulfill. Too many seeds getting killed, Lord, we need your will. To restore and rebuild, no more seeds getting killed. We got seeds in the field, with many dreams to fulfill. Too many seeds getting killed, Lord, we need your will. To restore and rebuild, no more seeds getting killed. Oh, uh, if you don't know, you reap what you sow. What goes around, come back around for you. Plant good seed and good soil. 
be loyal, your kids is watching you. Look up to your pops who stand for you. Plant good seed and good soil you. And remember Christ died for you. He saved me from that water, baptized me in that blood, filled me with his spirit, introduced me to that love. He saved me from that water, baptized me in that blood, filled me with his spirit, introduced me to that love. Yes, yes, welcome to another Sunday with us with your boy Dre, and I'm telling you, it has been quite the week, but here we are again for another Sunday with Nuts with your boy Dre. And you know what? I'm getting emotional right now. I know I say it a lot. I say it quite a bit. Matter of fact, I, so I, I think I, I think I say it. I think I think I say it all the time. But I really do. I do mean it this time. Not like I didn't mean it that last time. Or that last time I said, you know what, this could probably be the last time that's the last time. But I miss you guys. And I'm so glad you took out just a small amount of your time <laughs> to share it with me. Another Sunday with not so much a boy Dre. And I would be remiss if I didn't take this opportunity to uh thank Elation Magazine and Miss Kimberly Robinson, the visionary that she is, for giving me such a wonderful platform in which I used to help so many people. Elation Magazine and guys, this next weekend, well, this coming weekend because this weekend is already over. But this coming weekend, I'm telling you, if if you if you're not there, you're missing it. It is Elation Honors, and I'm telling you, we're going to have a blast in St. Louis. I'm looking forward to it. Your boy's hosting, and I'm telling you, we're honoring servant leaders, and it's going to be a huge night. I'm looking forward to it. Don't meet me there. Beat me there. Elation's Magazine, I'm so excited. Elation's Radio is just it, and Miss Kimberly Robinson has got this thing growing. It's like wildfire spread, man, and the excitement. I can feel it already. I can't wait to get there. But I also must tell you that I'm not doing this for me. I'm doing it for you because you are the uh... No, no, please. I don't, I don't do this for the applause. I do it because, well, I care about you. Y'all messed up. Y'all got trouble. And I am a trouble fixer, a trouble solver, a problem solver. I don't do it for me. I do it for y'all because I'm going to write y'all crazy and y'all got problems. And I help and I give back. Let's start giving back. Let's start helping right now. This first segment is the church play too much. I'm telling y'all, I'm so excited. Ooh, man, I'm giving y'all some good help tonight. The church play too much. I'm going to give you some examples of the church playing too much. Now, y'all know, times like these, we need the church. We need the Lord. Yes, we do. But now, every church ain't about it the way they need to be about it. Now, it could be your church that's playing too much. It could be a family member's church that plays too much, a, a friend, a co-worker, stranger in the street, someone, just, someone you see at your local grocery store at the bank, or someone you pass as you're walking through the park on a beautiful, sunny, but somewhat cold day. Because uh, it's cold out there. I believe it's our duty and obligation to point out to people, hey, man, your church is playing too much. Maybe you need to find a church home because that ain't the one for you. If you don't recognize any of these in any of the churches that you've been to, well, that's because all of them are tied into the church you go to, and you're wrong for that. The church played too much. Here we go. Examples of how the church is just playing too much. Let me tell you what. The church played too much. The pastor's wearing eyeliner. Come on. Come on. The pastor's wearing eyeliner. The church played too much. Number two, the church played too much. The church doing check advance so you can pay your tithe and not wait on your check. Let me tell you something. I wish somebody would ask me to do a, a pay the advance so that I can pay my dog on tithe and offer to the church. I wish I would. I wish I would. The church played too much, number three. The metal detectors are to make sure don't nobody bring no change in the church. Y'all ain't finna run that thing on my body. I keep change on me. Why? Because I need change. Number four, the church played too much. Handicapped parking space 
is across the street. Let me tell you something. <laughs> the handicapped parking space is across the street. Why are you making it hard on handicapped people? They should be right there at the door. But you're going to make them cross traffic. Come on, man. Ain't nothing but the devil. The church played too much, number five. The church mass choir has a total of eight members. How the hell is it is, is, is it going to be a mass choir when you just got eight members? You know what? I'm, I'm going to put this out there. About six, seven months ago, I went to, to visit the church, and they actually introduced a mass choir, and it had eight members. That's the only reason I said that. I ain't lying. For real. Eight members. A mass choir. That ain't no mass. That's a mass choir. Come on, man. The church played too much. Number six, the church got a bump and grind ministry. <clears throat> a bump and grind ministry at the church. <laughs> wow. The church played too much. They got a weed smoking area. Come on now. And uh, you smoke your cigarettes is bad enough. But if you got a, a, a designated area for you to go smoke your weed, I don't care if it is for medicinal purposes. The church is playing too much. Uh, Number eight, the church played too much. They got a work release program. Well, there's nothing wrong with that. That's good. Wait a minute. They got a work release program teaching convicts toasters. First of all, ain't nobody using it. Who buys toasters anymore? Who buys toasters? You ain't teaching these people nothing. You ain't giving them nothing they can go out and make no money and, and, and use. A toaster, you fix, you teaching these people how to repair toasters. Ain't no, look, they ain't going to have no job. Ain't going to be no work because people don't use toasters. They didn't throw them, they didn't throw them away. Stop it. Getting that government funding for nothing. You ain't teaching these people nothing. You know, you know what? You ought to teach them how to uh, 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 re- repair their uh, bad credit and repair their life, but not toasters. Come on. The church played too much. Number nine. Selling dinner plates for ten dollars, which consists of a paper plate with three fish sticks, a small bag of Doritos, and a cinnamon roll for ten dollars. <laughs> That's how folks get their feelings hurt in their face punch. Uh, finally, the church played too much. Selling T-shirts that read Trump. That's my nick. Oh, you know what? Yes, okay. I'm, I, I I didn't say the word, but he had that, uh, the church played too much. All right. Uh, now, I, I told y'all I'm happy y'all tonight, and I'm so excited. I can't tell man, I'm telling you, elation, honors for serving leaders. This, I'm telling you, it's going to be, whoo, this is, <laughs> things white people do uh, that uh, and black people do, that's the same but just different. Things white people do, black people do. That's the same, but just different. See, we all the same. We all created by the same God, and we do things the same way, just a little different. See, it's just tweaked a little bit different, okay? But it has the same meaning. Here it goes. Things white people do that black people do, but just different. Number one, uh, when they kids acting bad, white people, what they do is they, uh, well, they kids get time out. Yeah. Uh, black people kids. When they're acting bad, uh, black people, kids, they get knocked out. It is still an out. It's just time out versus knocked out. Well, technically, if you're knocked out, then you're, time out, you're in time out, too, and you need time to recover. So, again, things that white people do and black people do, the same but just different. Uh, number two, things that white people do and black people do, that's the same but just a little bit different. Now, white people do this, okay? They will catch a fish, show it off, and throw it back in the water. Okay, black people that catch a fish, uh, they'll show it off and then they uh, throw it in the skillet of hot grease. See, so they do the same thing but different. They they both throwing it somewhere. Okay, and number three things white people do, black people do, they do the same thing but just a little different. Uh, white people do this. Uh, oh my gosh, they got an old family member that's sick, you know, and 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 and, and, and they 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 just you know they need help, need somebody to care for. What white people do. Uh, they uh, they put the uh, family member in a in a rest home. They, they sure do. They they will do that. They will. Uh, black people. They got a family member, old family member, uh, relative that you know this you know need need constant uh, supervision. It needs help. Somebody take care of them. what black people do. Um, what we do is we'll put them in a hospital bed in, in the living room. <laughs> I 
I look. Y'all didn't. How many black people? Uh, y'all know good well. Uh, Big Mama had a a a a, 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 a brother, a, a one of her sisters, or one of her cousins maybe, in a hospital bed in the living room. Sure was, and wasn't nobody no nurse. <laughs> Come on, man. Number four. Say black people, white people do, and black people do the same but different. White people, they do this. Mm, mm, mm. When they family pet, they family dog gets sick, you know they don't take them to the vet. Show sure where they don't care. They take it. They 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 don't, they gonna say Fido. Black people when the family pet uh, gets sick, we're gonna take it to the middle of nowhere, tell it to get out, and then we gonna hit the gas. Uh, they white people do, black people do. It's the same, but just different. What they do is this, okay? They ask their kids to stop talking while they're talking. They say, stop talking. Stop talking while I'm talking. So that's what they do. They do say, hey, hey, be quiet so you can hear what I'm saying. Uh, black people, what we do is we say, we, we actually ask our kids, say something else. I wish it did. Say something else. Huh? See, we, we the same thing, but just different. Number six, what white people do, and black people do, but we just do a little different. Uh, this is what they do. Uh, white people, they will show up to work early just to go to work. <laughs> yes, indeed. Black people will show up to work early just to go on, on the Internet. See, we both showing up early. They just show up to work. We just show up to get on the Internet. Come on, man. We're doing the same thing. We're both showing up early. Uh, number seven, what white people do and black people do is the same, but just a little different. This is what they do, y'all. Uh-uh. Mm-mm-mm-mm-mm. It's, it's, if they hit somebody's car and put a dent in, what they're going to do is leave a note. They show go. They're going to do that. I had it happen to me about four or five years ago. They show did. Yeah. Ran into my car, hit my car. You know, didn't hurt it too bad, but they put a dent in the door. And left a note. So white people, they dent somebody's car, they're going to leave a note. Black people, this is what we do. We dent somebody's car, we're going to leave tire tracks. Ain't that what you're saying? All right. White people, black people, they do the same thing, just a little bit different. This is what white people do, y'all. Um, <clears throat> white people do this. Uh, they find some stolen money, they're going to turn it into the police. So that's the right thing to do. Uh, legally, it is. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Um, black people, what we do is we find some stolen money, we're going to turn it into a good time. We both turn it into something. They just turn theirs into the police. We turn ours into a good time. Uh, white people, black people, uh, I'm telling you, we do, we do things the same way, but just a little bit different. That is what they do, okay? Uh, white people, mm-hmm. they loan money. They're going to pay their uh, car payment on time. Show sure is. Black people, we loan money. We're going to pay our car payment, too, just in time. As <laughs> soon as we hit the tow truck, we're making that call. Will you take a debit card? <laughs> I'm telling you, white people and black people, we do the same thing, okay? But just a little bit of difference. Oh, my gosh. I'm telling you, I'm helping y'all tonight because I love you and I care about you, okay? Okay, okay, okay. Now, this next segment, I'm telling you now, Woo-wee. <laughs> this is one of the staples of the Sunday with Nuts with Dre. And I'm telling you, man, the reason why I love to do this is because this is out of order. And I'm telling you, this segment has helped so many people. Let's jump right into it because there's a lot of people that's living an out-of-order life, okay? Could be you, out of order. Could be a family member, out of order. Could be a friend. Could be a coworker, a stranger in the street, someone you see at your local grocery store or at the bank, someone you pass as you're walking through the park on a beautiful, sunny, yet chilly day. Because it's being cold, the temperature's dropping. I believe it's our duty and obligation to point out things to people that are out of order in their life so they can do what? Get their life in order. Now, if you don't recognize any of these, I repeat, any of these, and anybody you know, shame on you. They are all tied in the year. And you are living an out-of-order life. Get your life in order, okay? Be better, do better. Only if you want better. If this is you, you're out of order. Mm-hmm. You take your seven-year-old daughter to get her tongue pierced. I don't, I, I, I don't, I, I have no idea what your motivation behind that is. Uh, is that something she suggested? Has that been on her bucket list ever since she was four, five years old? To get our tongue pierced. If this is you, you out of order. Mm-hmm. You grown. 
but you at McDonald's playing on the slide with other people's kids. I tell you what, you, that's that, 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 that. don't mess around and get choked till you pass out. Sicko. If this is you, you out of order. Your nose has so long, people think you got a mustache. Okay. 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 If this is you, you out of order. If you still trick or treating <laughs> after you get out of work. Wait a minute. 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 Hold up. I I just need y'all to understand how how, how out of order this one is too. Halloween night. You go trick or treat after you didn't get out of work. How the hell old is you to, be, to have a job? Leave your job and then go trick or treat. Come on, come on, come on, come on. If this is you, you out of order. If you ask the judge to put you on house arrest and you homeless, come on now, come on. You can't be in court asking the judge to put you on house arrest and you homeless. What? Basically, he is freeing you. You got no boundaries. If this is you, you out of order. Oh my God. If you on your way to take a drug test for your new job and get arrested for DUI, <laughs> you know what? Yeah. Oh, to say you're probably not gonna get the job. If this is you, you out of order. You so nasty. Your favorite black bra women used to be your favorite white bra. Come on now, that is just dirty and stank. Your favorite black bra used to be your favorite white bra. Come on. If this is you, you out of order. Mm-hmm. If you feeding your goldfish fish sticks, wait a minute. So you didn't turn the fish into cannibals. Boy. If this is you, you out of order. Mm-hmm. If you're showing your six-year-old son how to roll weed. Or how much these that? That's yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, that's uh, all right. Finally, if this is you, you out of order. If your doctor give you bad news, you get mad and decide not to pay the bill. <laughs> Wait a minute, okay. What? He only tells you the truth. <laughs> Why are you mad at him? You the one did that to your body. Mm, 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 mm. Boy, if y'all don't get y'all life right, I don't know what to say about you. you just, please, just stop. Just stop. Anyway, I, again, I'm not doing this for me. I'm doing this for y'all because y'all need help. Y'all need help because y'all know y'all terrible. Okay? Oh, Lord Jesus. This next segment is called, You Know the Devil Busy. You know the devil busy. You know what? Uh, the devil's always busy. And he come to steal, kill, and destroy but you have to be prayed up. Stay prayed up because he's busy. Now, if you don't recognize that the devil is busy trying to destroy you, then you got to be ashamed of yourself. You're not paying attention. I'm going to give you some examples of how you know the devil is busy. Number one, you know the devil is busy when this happens. You change price tickets on what you can't afford at the store. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. You take the price off of something cheap and put it on something more expensive. Yeah, that technically that is stealing. I've done that before. Trust me. It is stealing. Number two, you know the devil's busy if this happens. If you're in a restaurant with somebody, the check coming, y'all both ignore it. Come on, man. <laughs> so y'all just going to sit there forever. <laughs> How the hell long can a conversation last? You know, devil busy if this happens. Mm, mm, mm. mm, mm, mm. Somebody asks you, "Do you want to hold their baby?" And you say, "No, girl, I'm scared. I might throw that thing." Wait a minute. Come on, <laughs> come on, come on, stop. Oh, you could have been a little more subtle. Okay, <laughs> you basically call the baby ugly without calling the baby ugly. You know, the devil busy is this if this is happening. Mm, mm, mm. Bill Cosby and R. Kelly are pen pals. Wait a minute. Stop it. Stop it. You know the devil's busy if this is happening. You go to H&R Block, sign up for your refund check, spend it 
in one day, and the next day report yourself. <laughs> y'all better stop because y'all know tax time is right around the corner now. Let's quit. If, you know the devil's busy if this is happening. You handed out last year's Christmas candy to kids at church. Yeah. You know the devil's busy if this is happening. You're at work on the internet applying for another job. <laughs> <laughs> they love to give me because I have done that before. <laughs> oh my God! Matter of fact, I need to go to work tomorrow to erase my resume. Uh, delete that thing right out there. <laughs> delete that whole file. Uh, no, mate. You know the devil's busy if you're doing this. Mm-hmm. You praying for one of the mothers in the church and pull her wig off. <laughs> Oh, get them behind me, Satan. I did not know that woman was bald like that. You know the devil's busy. It just happened. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> you pull out a wad of cash and start counting your money in front of a homeless person and then just walk off. You know what? Come on. Just evil. And finally, you know the devil's busy if this is happening. Oh, my God. If you ask a blind person out to dinner, but on one condition, they got to drive. Wait a minute. <laughs> How they going to come pick you up? How they going to, you know what? Uh, quit playing with people like that. Please. Please. Again, I'm not doing it for me. I'm doing it for y'all because y'all need help, and you're welcome. I'm telling y'all, elation, honor is going to be off the chain. I'm giving it to them. I'm giving it. I can't wait. I'm, I'm wee. This next thing is called tip the tat. Tip the tat. I love this segment because you know what? This is biblical. Tip the tat. Yeah. Do on the others as they have done on the you. That's biblical. So it's tip the tat. In sinner's terms, it's tip the tat. Yeah, and I practice tit for tat because I like to do on the others as they have done on to me. Um, tit for tat. Uh, examples. Wait a minute. If you're, at the, if you're at the grocery store and I see you buy all the toilet paper, I'm going to buy all the air freshener. Now, we're going to need each other. Trust me. We're going to need each other. Tit for tat. Mm-hmm. You talk about my hair. I reach up and snatch your hair piece off. Tip for tap. Tip for tap. Tip for tap. Uh, you blow your hot breath in my face. I hit you in your neck and shove a tic tac down your throat. Tip for tap. Uh, tip for tap. You know what? Uh, I don't know if you guys are into politics. And of course, you know, we've got the, uh, you know, we still got the monkey pox in there saying there's another variant of, uh, Corona, you know, that you need to get a booster shot, you know, because everything's going going on. And they're talking about a possible, possibly giving another stimulus check out, which, you know what I'm saying? They got no problem with that. Man, give me some money. I'll take free money. The, one, the, 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 the best kind of money for me is free money. I ain't got to work for it either. Man, you better give me the money, please. But they talk about, you know, maybe a, possibly another, uh, just a – Boost the economy because you know everything is so overpriced now. It's it's ridiculous. They're talking about possibly another round of uh, checks, and I'm like, man, send me a Corona check. I take a Corona check. But now there's some things you need. You need to be responsible with your money. There's some there's certain things you should never do, and you just don't do it with your Corona check. And I call it Corona check because I call it what the hell I want. It's my money. They give it to me anyway. Uh, just going to give you some examples of uh, things you should not do with your Corona check if you get it. Um, uh, number one, uh, get your summer clothes out the lead with. Don't do that. Don't do that. Don't do not do that with your Corona check. I, I, don't, uh, I, I don't recommend that. Number two, uh, buy lottery tickets. Don't spend it on lottery tickets. <laughs> you stupid boy. Okay. Uh, number three, uh, buy rims for your baby daddy's car. Especially if the baby daddy, hey, wait a minute, shouldn't he be getting a check too? What's he doing with his check? Okay. Um, don't do this with your Corona check. Buy 
Corolla. Don't spend it all on Corolla. You know what? Get you a couple of Bud Lights, maybe a six-pack of Bud Lights, man, and go about your business, okay? Don't do this with your Corolla check. Pay past due doctor bills. Why? He might not make it. I'm just playing. But you know what? Just uh, just make sure you got insurance and, and, and let your insurance pay for it, okay? Uh, don't do this with your uh, Corolla check. Invest it in the stock market. Why? Who the hell does that? Uh, don't do this with your Corona check. Uh, get your hair and nails done. Don't spend it on hair, hair and nails, please, okay? Put that away. I mean, use it for you and your family, okay? Get, the, buy the, 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 the necessities, okay? Right? The, the Corona check is not for luxuries. It's for necessities, okay? Don't do this with your Corona check. Uh, pay the deposit on your vacation cruise. Why? 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 Don't do this with your corona check. Lend money to your friend waiting on their corona check. <laughs> ain't that stupid? Some of y'all gonna do that though, ain't you? And then when they get their check, you ain't gonna be able to find them. Idiot. You brought that on yourself, stupid. Uh finally, don't do this with your corona check. If you do this, I'm telling you, you need to be slapped three times a day by four different people. Figure that math out. Don't do this. If you get your corona check, give it back. <sighs> <laughs> oh, again, I'm not doing this for me. I'm doing this for y'all because y'all got problems. Y'all are ate up with the stupid. Some of y'all, not all of y'all, but some of y'all really do need this help, and I'm glad to be able to help you. Finally, we come to the church announcements, and I'm telling you, if we ever needed some good God and body in our life, we need it now. The midterms, I'm telling you, it's just been crazy. Who going to control the House? Who going to control the, the Senate? Who controlling this? Who controlling that? Who's going to make these laws? Who's going to get these bills passed? It don't make no doubt no sense. God is in control regardless. Stop worrying about that stuff. Do your due diligence with all these candidates, and then ex- exercise your right to vote, okay? It is, it, it is a right, and so exercise that, okay? More than ever. Okay, because it's important. Let your voice be heard. But I'm telling you, God is still in control. So come and get your good God and mighty praise on with us. Please, we ask you, come as you are. Get your praise and worship on with us at our church. Well, we do nothing but praise and worship. But we are the Jesus take the wheel. I got the gas. Baptist church. Now, we're small in number, but we are big in faith. See, that's an explosion. See, I said we are small in number, but we are. <laughs> I almost shook the room with that one. Anyway, uh, the reason why I like to do the church announcements is because I want to make sure everyone's uh, kept abreast of what's going on within the church. Everyone's on the same page, okay? That we're all united, okay? We're all the one body, mind, and spirit. There's no saint left behind. I like to do the church announcements for individuals that um, may not have been able to attend the in-person services uh, in the sanctuary or individuals uh, that uh, may not have access to the internet and can't watch us as we stream the sick did 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 in the shut it up it. also like to do the church announcements for individuals that may have been in attendance in the in-person sanctuary service and may have been watching us as we stream but missed some parts or all of the announcements because they were busy worrying about stuff they had no business worrying about let me tell you, <laughs> first of all, it ain't nobody's business, okay? It ain't nobody's business about how me and my wife make our money, okay? We ain't stealing for the church. We ain't got to steal from the church, okay? For your information, <laughs> yes, we drive a new Mercedes Benz. Okay, that ain't got nothing to do with the church. Okay, I, and I am somebody that I am a pastor that is totally transparent. Okay, yes, we did. We did get a new Mercedes Benz, and yes, it is over a hundred thousand dollars. Yes, we we did that, but it wasn't the church's money. People are asking, how can we afford that? Well, truth be told, we can't afford it, and we're not going to afford it. We signed, we misspelled both our names on there. So technically, we're driving these cars for free. She got her one, I got me one. We know what we're doing. We've been hustling for a mighty long time. We ain't always been saved. 
<laughs> Please, we don't have to play this game. Now we're going to drive it for another 40 to 45 days, hide it for a couple of weeks, and, and then when they find it, they come and get it back. But until then, <laughs> we were rolling. <laughs> Bowling! Anyway, nothing more. Uh, due to uh, no sanctuary service uh, next week uh, because the uh, church is going to be uh, through, uh, um, well, I wouldn't say renovation, but all they're doing is spraying for rats and roaches. But uh, anyway, uh, but due to that, there will be uh, no sanctuary service uh, next Sunday. So uh, the uh, the first lady and I will be driving by each individual home to collect tithes and offerings and make sure you add a little extra for gas money. Uh, and that's number two. In the wake of uh, uh, all these rich and famous pastors uh showing uh, uh showing you know uh the way uh well because they've been showing the way i will be sending a couple of our members to meet with them and figure out how to better fleece i mean feed the flock uh so uh minister uh nichols will be meeting with uh pastor uh Colin and uh, Deacon Dimes uh, will break bread with Pastor Denlin, okay? Uh, we're just trying to figure out, you know, how they're making their money and how they're hiding their money from the government uh, so we can get to come up, too. I mean, I'm trying to be rich, too. You know what I'm saying? And see, so if the people is paying it, if they stupid, they paying it, hey, I'm trying to get it, too. <laughs> okay. He <laughs> says in his word, God would not have his children ignorant and uh it's money out there and I'm trying to get it too. Uh anyway, uh that's number three. Whoever left a bag of weed on the top of the refrigerator in the uh church's kitchen, let's just say it went up in smoke. Ain't no sense of going to look for it. Finally, we get to the building fund. The building fund is always something I look forward to, not looking forward to, for it offers a little bit of everything, intrigue, mystery, horror, comedy, but most of all, unpredictability. As of the day, the building fund has raised, and I quote, next to nothing, next to nothing. Uh, I don't, uh, next to nothing. Is it something? But what some? anyway. Well, thank you so much for joining me for another Sunday with Nuts with your boy, Dre. And like I always do, I'm going to pray us out. So I ask you, please, all heads are bowed, all eyes are closed, unless, of course, you're blind. Then it really don't matter, does it? I mean, seriously, for real, really? Wow. Huh? Oh, Lord. We thank you for another Sunday with Nuts with Dre. We thank you for another opportunity to come together and find faith and fellowship. Thank you for making a way or no way. What way is that other uh, other way? Thank you for opening doors and no man can shut. Hold that door. Thank you for being a doctor in the sick room. What room is that? The room you over there coughing in, sucker. Thank you for being a lawyer in the courtroom. Guilty, not guilty, mistrial, overruled. But most of all, we thank you for being God and God alone. For loving us more than we can love you or even ourselves. Now continue to hold us close to your bosom. Continue to bless us and keep us. Give us renewed strength. Continue. To shower us with your favor. We will be mindful to give you the honor, glory, and praise. In Jesus' name we do pray. Amen. And amen. You guys have a great night. I will see you that well, you know what? <laughs> yeah, I'm going to Lations on a baby. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. Don't meet me there. Be me there. I don't I I'm not saying in the physical, because man, you put your hands on me, we fight. But, man, I love you. There's nothing you can do about it. If you try, I'm telling you, I hurt you because my love hurts, okay? Like I love Tina. My love hurts. You guys be blessed and not stressed. See you. And I wouldn't want to be. Why? I really don't know y'all that well. I don't know what you got going in your life. I'm not the type of person you are. You can be a terrible person, a person. I'm a good person. So I'd rather be me before I be you until I get to know you. But you guys, take care. I miss you already. See you when I see you. I feel-
feel like Bruce Banner. Can't nobody stop me. My plug got the answer. I know my God got me. I'm unstoppable. You can't stop with this mess to prosper. Nah. Got them hits like an L.A. Dodger. Yeah. God chose me, put me on the roster. Yeah. Chasing goals, I want Grammys and Oscars. Took some losses, but I'm still a winner. Been forgiven, but I'm still a sinner. Wanna see me fail? That won't happen, though. I'm the front page in the center fold. I can't be stopped. I got the power. My enemies looking real sour. Trying to hold me back like rush hour. All obstacles, I straight devour. No one's gonna stop me. I promise I don't play. You don't wanna with me. I'm coming, no delay. Hear a lot of talking, no matter what he say. Turn another hustle, I'm bringing that heat wave. He say, she say, you can't stop me. 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 Coast to coast, I read the host to host. I got the Holy Ghost, I do not need to boast. Nah, strength within, release through the pen. Write about my sin, cause it inspires men. Humble with the talent, let him put me on high. The power that is in me can't be seen like Wi Fi. Overcome and look at fear and tell it bye bye. Undefeated through the Lord, no, I won't lie. Oh my, oh my, you don't wanna waste time, it'll fly by, fly by. Came into the game, it was on in vain.